What is the maximum flow rate that the Hayward super pump variable speed can get through inch and a half plumbing? Well, let's test that and find out, but you should be aware that every swimming pool system is different. This is just going to be for my system. Yours is going to be unique. The distance from the pump to the pool, the amount of twists and turns used in the pipe, just the length of pipe, the size of the pipe, all of these things will matter. And so this is just an example of one real life application, but your numbers will be different than this. Uh, that being said, the system here is set up with a single inch and a half suction line. We have two inch through the pump and the filter. The filter is a 150 square foot uh, Hayward cartridge filter. The pump is the model SP2603 VSP. That's the 230 volt super pump variable speed. Out through the pressure side here, we're going to be isolating through that single inch and a half line and measuring our flow rate through that yellow digital meter there. Let's go ahead and get started and look at our maximum flow rate. And just for um, the, the comparison here, I believe that this system is about 30 feet of head resistance. All right, so. 34.50, maximum speed. Let's take a look at the pressure here. Just, just over 10 PSI. And here's the information you wanted. The maximum flow rate that I am able to achieve with inch and a half plumbing is approximately 71 gallons per minute, maybe just a little over 71. And the power consumption, 1.26 kilowatts, 1,260 watts, that's the top right. On the left you see 8.33, 8.32 amps of current draw at 230 volts. If you found this information helpful, please be sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And you can check out my website, swimmingcoolsteve.com.